What's up guys, Moritz here from Section Store. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how you can install this below payments icon card section here for your very own Shopify store. It causes to like create attraction to that little area here and maybe bring customers to easily buy your product and increase the conversion rate. If you're wondering what that is, that is also part of the section store app store. So we already did a video on it. We're gonna put it in the link, but for this video, we're only gonna do how to add this safe payment section here. So first of all, we're gonna be installing the section store itself. For that, you're gonna be heading on over to the Shopify app store, type in section store, theme sections, and add the app to your Shopify area. In the next step, you're gonna be heading on over to the Shopify development area. Look at apps, click section store. Wait a little bit for it to load, look for sections. And then in the second row, we have it here already. So let's click on it, you can see it here. It's a one-time purchase of $9. It's not a subscription or anything. It's a premium section of ours. So you just pay the $9 once and own the section forever. Easy as that. After you've done that, you're gonna head to the home area of the section store app again. Scroll down a little bit, depending on how many sections you already own. Then you have it right here. Next thing you wanna do is add it to your theme. In my case, it's gonna be the Dawn light theme. And after you've done that, you're gonna open up the theme editor right here, which I've done already in my case. And that's the one you already saw in the little sample page I just showed you. So you're gonna head to the product page. For this tutorial, I'm gonna remove it real quick. So I'll just click on that one, click it out. So as you can see, it's here in a weird way, but after we save it up, it's going to disappear. So we have a blank page and I can perfectly show you how you can customize it and everything. All right, now it's gone. So you scroll to the bottom of that little side navigation here, click on add section, type in SS, which stands for section store. Find the payment icons right here, click on them, save it up again. And in a second, we should have it right here. Perfect, easy as that. So you can also do some customizations. That's one of our main um, special things about the whole section store uh, that we have customizable sections. So what we can do is click on the payment icons themselves. We can do some little changes like uh, change the text size, for example. We can make that a little bit bigger. You saw already, it's like scrolling up a little bit change the icon size. Right now it's in 60 pixels. We can also make it a little bit smaller for this tutorial, just to see that it's actually doing the changes so you can see more icons in one row. You can also switch it in the mobile version. So if you do a little change here, it's gonna be smaller at mobile. You can add a background color. In this case, we're gonna be using that one. So we get a little background color here. I was more happier with white, so we just switch back to that actually. Um, we can also change is the actual position of the section itself. So we can actually put it above the add to cart section. So let's just select that for once so you can see it. Save it up again. In a second, we should have it in the right spot. There we go, above the add to cart section. Also, we can make the text color, which is transparent right now. Different, so here you can see it. Now we have a different text color. We're gonna be sticking for that for this tutorial. And that was the main section itself. We can also do some little, uh, some little customizations to the icons, which you can see right here. We have like a bunch of different items and all of these items are representing one of those little cards here. So all the ones you're seeing already are default ones, but you can easily change it up with just clicking on them. And right now there is a SVG in it, but um, if we look, for example, 
at the Bootstrap icon library. I'm just going to be showing you how you can simply add some in there. So let's just do a really generic one. For example, this little Android figure here. But I think you, you get the whole point behind it. You scroll down here, copy the HTML, go back to the Shopify store. We can see the width is 226 and the height is 167. So we kind of try and aim to get the same size on that one. So we paste it in. So we're just going to have a width of around about 200 and a height of 200 as well, because it's a square icon. Save it up and have a look at it in a second. Let's see how a little icon is going to look like. There we have it, our little Android icon, and it's also having the same color as our headline we selected here. You can also change that with typing in a hexadecimal code, and that's pretty much it. Let's have a look at it, how it's going to look like. Open the whole thing up. Okay, go to the catalog, look for a product, a party live setup in this example. And there you got it, your little payment icon section for your very own Shopify store. You can use that for whatever you prefer, drop shipping or just any online store. So I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, always feel free to reach out to me or Daniel in the comment section of this YouTube video or just directly on Shopify. Have a good day, guys, and peace out. Bye-bye.